Okay, so I am here. My name is Lewis on Twitter. I go by the name Civil Fandom. And I am here today to open up my first ever box of Boom, King of Pro Wrestling Cards, Conprudo. Uh, recently just got into these things, uh, really nifty collector cards. And the reason why I'm actually doing a video for this is actually because I got these off of, you know, Prudo Central Shop. Dot com really great shop everyone should check out great businessman's running that shop Kevin Wilson and you know just looking to support his cause because his merchandise there is just phenomenal got a really great mug and a bunch of other stuff from there and just gonna go right into this really quickly to make sure that hey we all get a good bit of you know the kind of merchandise that is on the store and you know of course my own personal enjoyment of seeing these cards so Without further ado, I'm going to open the Strong Style Pack, Volume 15. Uh, volume 16 is actually coming out really soon, and I'm looking forward to that. I'm going to jump on that right away. So, here we go. Oh! Kevin, if you're watching me, I know you did this on purpose. <sighs> the Taguchi card. The Taguchi card. You did this on purpose. But for those of you who don't know, this is Taguchi, the bane of the bane of existence when it comes to being a fan of New Japan Pro Wrestling. So if anyone's watching this and you want to trade, I'll give you anything. Anything so you can take this card off my hands. It's not starting out well. So then, hopefully, you know, that's the only bad thing I'm going to get. And we can proceed further without any more hiccups. Taguchi hiccups, that is. Okay, then. These packs are really hard to open, by the way. Ugh. Okay. So, got this one finally open. And we got... Ah, Mr. G1 Climax winner himself. Tanahashi. As far as I'm concerned, you know, although I'm not the biggest Tanahashi fan, this man has just had a phenomenal 2015 top wrestler of the year in my opinion so yeah really nice really nice card to have and continuing with that theme which is kind of ironic i have his leg breaker and the reason why this is bittersweet it's on kota ibushi anyone who knows me knows uh kota ibushi right now is probably my favorite wrestler in all of new japan pro wrestling so bittersweet that he's doing it to kota ibushi in that match that it took place the g1 climax Match of the Year candidate. It was phenomenal. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. And, ooh! Tanahashi lifting his trophy in victory. Pre-flag break for those of you who are watching it. So, not bad for the first open pack. You know, I got the god that is Tanahashi. And, really good cards to start off. So, let's see where things go from here. Hopefully, you know, no more Taguchi again. Probably jinxing myself for saying that a lot. Ugh. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Again, I'm very atrocious at opening these cards. Opening packs is not my thing. It's really not. But finally got this one open. And the first one is... Ah! Tranquilo, ladies and gentlemen. Tranquilo. Naito. This man has had a career renaissance thanks to joining Los Ingobernables and... Really happy to get this card. <laughs> and the follow-up card is Naito bitch-slapping Shibata. No, I don't hate Shibata. I actually love Shibata. I think these guys had great, great matches together this year. <sighs> and, of course, I think just perfectly articulates, you know, their relationship currently. Ah. And I got Nagata delivering a nice front kick. Uh, always good to get a Nagata card. I think Nagata is probably one of the more underutilized people in New Japan simply because even though he's at the age he's at currently right now, this man still puts on great, great matches. So not bad to have a Nagata card. Opening pack number three. And ugh, it's not going too well. Another Tanahashi repping his G1 trophy. So, well. Uh, that was okay. 
I do trade, so this will come in handy. And another leg breaker. Mm, not a good booster pack to open up. Glad I got a box or so I have more packs to go through. And uh, Yoshihashi, a.k.a. Taco. Yoshihashi is always an interesting character. We all know he looks like the Monkey King. And I love his staff. I think it's a really great staff. I wish he used it as a weapon more often in matches. Just add another dimension. But yeah, not a bad card. Not a bad card at all. Nice and shiny. I'm just happy I actually didn't get another Tanahashi. Uh, I, I was just glad that, that box wasn't just a retread of the first pack I opened where it was, you know, all Tanahashi cards. Because, you know, Tanahashi wins low. Okay, so on to the next pack. And I swear, opening these packs is... It's a lot harder than it looks, people. Okay. Finally got this one open. So, Lord, please do not give me more Tanahashi. Tanahashi's great, but no more. Ooh. Hiroki Goto. Goto had a... Goto had a good year. You know, Goto's been... Messed around a lot by, you know, Gato's booking, but he had a good year, you know, him and his God of Thunder attire here, repping his IWGP Intercontinental title that, unfortunately, he no longer holds because, you know, Nakamura took the belt back, you know, because Nakamura went slow. And I've got a Goto Neckbreaker. Mm, not bad, and <sighs> I swear, Kevin is trying to troll me. Captain New Japan. The person who I dislike the most in all of New Japan Pro Wrestling is Captain New Japan. So for me to get that card, and not only that, get that card, but also get the Taguchi card as my promo card. <sighs> really not happen. Ugh, really not happy, really not happy at all. Ugh. But the power of positivity compels me. I will, they will get me back for opening those cards. And the first one I get is, oh, Samurai card. I'm actually, like, not a really, really uh, knowledgeable in New Japan Pro Wrestling. It's only just a new find for me over the past couple years. So I'm really not keen on the history of it. So I'm not really sure when this card is from. And, mm, yeah, this is a Samurai pack because here we got Samurai Clutch Move. It's pretty okay. And, ooh, Samurai Bomb! Really nice looking card. Really nice looking card. Looks great, looks great. Okay. So, I think I'm halfway through the box now. It's been a mixed blessing, I shall call it. You know, but again, power of positivity compels me. I will do better. I know I will. Okay, so, opening up this next pack. Let's see what it is. And the first card is... Ah, oh, yes! The Rainmaker. Kazuchika Okada. Kota Ibushi's number one for me in New Japan, but this guy, Kazuchika Okada, is number two for me. So any Okada card is a warm welcome on my part. And, yeah, Kazuchika Okada stomping on Fale's head. It's pretty cool. He's just like, you're nothing. I'm the champion. You're nobody. And <sighs> I, don't th I think I don't need to say anything about that card. I think my reaction speaks for itself. <sighs> uh... See, now I think the fates are working against me because... For sheer entertainment value, the more I get cards like that, the more it's driving me crazy, and the more viewers are probably enjoying my reaction. So first things first. Ooh, here we go. Jushin Thunder Liger. Okay, one of the most legendary figures in Japanese wrestling. Mm, this guy is really good, really good guy. And... <sighs> okay, this card I love for so many reasons. One, because of course it's Liger. Two... It's palm strike and three because he's doing it to tiger mask 
I'm all for the legend of Tiger Mask and everything he represents. But, you know, the current incarnation of Tiger Mask, in my opinion, has overstayed his welcome. So, Liger bitch-smacking him, I enjoy so much. And, oh! Some young boy action. Flying Elbow Attacker! Oh, uh, yes. And this is Shotanaka doing this Flying Elbow Attack on Nakanishi, I believe. So, not bad, not bad. Everyone needs to get a young boy. Although my favorite young boy currently right now is Jay White, so I'd be holding out for that. Okay, so I've got three more packs left. Please, Lord, please give me some good stuff. Okay. And the first card is... King of Strong Style, Shinsuke Nakamura. Lovely pose. He's dressing very, very nice. This was the press conference, I believe, for World Tag League. And, of course, you know, he just owns any suit he wears. Not bad. I got... <sighs> Shinsuke being Shinsuke with his patented head droop on his opponent's chest to Goro. And Goro is just like, "What? I hate you so much for showing me up. So that's pretty cool. Yes! Probably my favorite card of the poll so far. Kushida with his Best of the Super Juniors trophy. Oh, and the Hammerlock on Kyle O'Reilly. Uh, I think Kushida's a great wrestler. Um, I'm still upset at the fact that he had to lose his IWGP title to Kenny Omega in the rematch. Uh, one of the most underrated wrestlers, which is funny when you think about it because of how much he wins. But at the same time, he still loses a lot. Yeah, and actually, here's the interesting part. I am a huge fan of Kyle O'Reilly. I think Kyle O'Reilly is an amazing wrestler who should be a world champion somewhere. But him, you can't be upset when he loses such a great match, a match of your candidate to a guy like Kushida. So, all around great, great stuff put on by those two guys. If you haven't seen that match, go watch it. Okay, okay. If anything, those Taguchi cards probably mean like, you know, you have to get some Taguchi in order to get a card like that, so... Yep. Okay. Moving on to the second to last pack. And let's make it good, guys. I've got Taco's back. I don't know what he's saying, but he looks like he's on a mission. So, Taco, ladies and gentlemen. And if I'm not mistaken, he's yelling over Goto. Ooh. Showing Goto that he's not as tough as he thinks he is. <sighs> Again, Taco. But this time, Schoolboy. And, of course, I love the little chalkboard adding to it. It's really creative stuff. Someone who works in education like me, I can appreciate that. And, ooh, shiny, shiny, shiny. Goto Hiroki. Pre-God of Thunder. But you know what? This is when he won the IWGP Intercontinental title from Nakamura. Uh, so, it's always good, always good. You know, Goto doesn't get the respect that he deserves sometimes. He's a great wrestler, but, you know. Fortunately, his fan base just isn't there. <sighs> Last pack. Last pack. Depending on how this pack pans out, determines whether or not I may order from Pewdal Central Shop again. I'm just playing. <laughs> I have more cards currently coming in the mail, so. Yeah, here we go. Oh, sleeper hold. Dave Finley doing it to Alex Shelley. Not bad. If I'm mistaken, this may be Shelley's match right before he got injured in the Super Juniors tournament, you know. So, yeah, don't mess with Finley. He'll, he'll put you out. <laughs> okay. I got Nagata doing the limbo. Mm, I love Nagata, but him doing the limbo is not something I want to see. Other people love it. I don't. So, yeah. Last card. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. Yes! Jushin Thunder Liger. Shiny and autographed. Great way to close out the pack. Great way to close out the box at that last card in the entire box. So, it was good, 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 good haul. Good haul overall. Uh, again, those, those couple cards I got. Yeah, I was set up. I was set up. But again, you know, 
you, you got to be happy with what you got. And also in my delivery that I ordered, I ordered an individual card. Kenta. Back when this man was the god of pro wrestling, Noah, you know, and just overall badass. He still is a badass, even though he's injured. You know, can't wait for this man to come back from injury and put on some great matches. So yeah, overall, good delivery. Fairly happy with what I got. There are a couple cards, you know, I was pulling for, hoping that I could get, but I didn't get it. So now I gotta find a way to get rid of those Taguchi cards. Alright? First video, I think it was okay, but I'm not gonna keep people here long. Later.